Hey, what's up everyone? You're here with Goran from Pick Dogs and you're here for your free picks for Wednesday, January 24th. Well, guys, we had only two games on Tuesday. The first one was between Chelsea and Middlesbrough in the EFL Cup. The second one was between Celta Vigo and Real Sociedad. Uh, Chelsea got the job done. They've uh, beaten Middlesbrough 6-1. They have qualified for the finale of that EFL Cup. Uh, however, with uh, all three picks that I gave out, we were actually one short. So... We had over six and a half shots on target uh, for Chelsea. They had six over seven and a half corners for Chelsea. They had seven and we had over two and a half cards for Middlesbrough. They had two cards in the game. So I don't know, quite an unlucky uh, game for us, but uh, it's the EFL Cup uh, with this cup competitions. We always have to be careful and uh, I'm not a big fan of betting on those. Uh, Celta Vigo is still in the battle with Real Sociedad. They're down 2-0 at the moment as I'm recording this video. Uh, but uh, for Wednesday, guys, we have four free picks. Uh, Fulham, Liverpool, Bayern versus Union, Berlin in Bundesliga. And we have a couple of games in the Spanish Copa del Rey. Uh, for more free picks, go up to the Pick Dogs YouTube channel and check it out, guys. Make sure you subscribe, hit that like button. And uh, for my best bets, click the link in the description. That will get you up to my page uh, where you can sign up on the Pig Dogs website. Get a daily pass, three-day pass, seven-day pass, or even a month-long pass if that's something you want to do. Like I said, guys, four uh, free picks here in this video. And let me just say I've uh, seen that uh, in the comments you guys have been asking me what books are providing the shots on target bets and stuff like that. Uh, if you're in Canada, simply message me on Twitter, guys, and I will more than happy to provide you the books that are uh, doing that in Canada. I'm not sure about the States, but uh, as I've heard from some friends, uh, FanDuel has it uh, in some states, at least I'm guessing. Uh, there's uh, Unibet as well, and uh, I'm not sure what, I think Bet365 has it, so... Uh, if you have access to any of these books and uh, your current books does not offer shots on target and corners and whatnot, check out some of the other ones and see if you like it. Let's get this show on the road, guys. Fulham versus Liverpool is the first game. And uh, you know what? Fulham has been actually quite solid at home this season. They haven't lost a lot of home games, only three or four uh, for the entire season, if I'm not mistaken. Let me just quickly look into that. Uh... So they lost four, five home games so far this season. Actually, yeah, f four, sorry. And the thing is that whenever they lose a home game, they never score a goal. So uh, all the other games that they played at home, they have actually won. So they either win or lose at home. And because of the fact that they are behind, they have lost the first leg 2-1 to Liverpool. They will have to go for it in this game. Now, we know that Liverpool has plenty of offense. Uh, and they will definitely try to score a goal here to kind of relieve the pressure uh, that they might find themselves under. But uh, they are coming off of a massive win in the EPL. Uh, they have been effective. They are scoring a lot of goals. And uh, they definitely deserve to be the favorites that they are right now. However, I think that Fulham will also go for it. They simply have to if they want to get to the finale of this competition. Uh, and for that reason, I'm going to take over nine and a half shots on target combined. And the price of that is minus 133. Now we are off to the Spanish Copa del Rey where we have uh, two games. The first one is between Mallorca and Girona. And uh, I gotta be honest, guys, there's no betting against Girona right now. They simply destroyed Sevilla this past weekend uh, in La Liga. And uh, they basically look unbeatable right now. They're playing well, uh, whether they played at home or on the road. And uh, I know that Mallorca has been decent. Uh, they have lost only one of their last uh, six games. Uh, they are undefeated in their last four games, but Girona hasn't lost any of their last 16 games and they were actually quite successful in this matchup against Mallorca as well. Uh, and for that reason, I'm simply going to take Girona on the money line at plus 118. I know that uh, uh, there's potentially a chance for penalty shootout and overtime here since this is a single leg matchup, so be careful with that. But at plus 116, we simply have to take Girona on the money line, even though it's on the road against the solid Mallorca team. So uh, I'm taking Girona on the money line. For our second Copa del Rey game, we have Athletic Bilbao playing against Barcelona. And uh, this is the one I'm going to keep very, very simple, guys. Uh, Athletic Bilbao failed to score against uh against Valencia in La Liga this past weekend. They ended up losing that game 1-0. And this is the first loss they 
suffered since late October. So uh, they were on a huge run. However, I don't think that that loss is going to shake them that much. Sure, they would definitely like to get a win or at least a point out of that game. But now they are facing this Barcelona team who is very, very unstable uh, defensively, especially when playing on the road. I think this is going to be a fairly even matchup. And as soon as one team gets on the scoreboard, I think that everything's going to open up and we're going to see a bunch of more chances and goals as well. And for that reason, both teams to score an over 2.5 at minus 102. Uh, that's going to be the pick I'm going to go with in this game between Bilbao and Barcelona. And for our final pick of this uh, video, guys, we have Bayern Munich hosting Union Berlin. Uh, that's a postponed game from a while back uh, from Bundesliga, and uh, Bayern Munich will be out for blood in this one. They ended up losing to Augsburg this past weekend in Bundesliga 1-0. And uh, it's, been, it's been probably one of the worst performances they had. They had 22 shots on target, uh, 22 shots overall, but only seven of those were on target. They had a lot of corner kicks. They had a ton of possession, uh, but uh, Augsburg was quite solid defensively. They even had three shots on target. They scored that one goal and got a precious win uh, against Bayern Munich. Uh, as far as Union Berlin goes, uh, the last game they played was 10 days ago against uh, Freiburg. Uh, one of their games was postponed last weekend because of the weather, and now they're facing Bayern Munich. Uh, they have been on a slight rise in the form, but uh, I'm not sure how much they have in themselves, in their tanks, to go against Bayern Munich here. Like I said, Bayern Munich will be uh, out for blood in this game. And uh, I, I believe that, I, I want to believe that uh, during this week, uh, during this few, few, few practices they had, uh, they were working on their uh, inefficiency from the previous game. And uh, this is usually when we see Harry Kane stepping up, where we see Musiala, Coman, even Leroy Sané stepping up. And uh, I honestly think that Union Berlin will suffer in this game and uh, they will suffer a lot. So uh, I do expect goals in this one, to be honest. Over two and a half at minus 278, uh, which isn't bad for Bayern Munich's games. But... Uh, I decided to take over four and a half corners in the first half, which is minus 139. We had the same pick in Bayern's last game against Augsburg. It was a nice win. Hopefully, we get uh, a, another nice win with this first half corners here as well. And the price is pretty solid uh, at minus 139. So, Bayern Munich versus Union Berlin, uh, over four and a half corners in the first half at minus 139. That's it, everyone. Thank you for joining me here. Uh, these were the free picks uh, for Wednesday. Uh, I hope you have a great day, guys. Good luck with all of your bets. And like I said, if you need uh, answering any questions about uh, books available uh, in Canada, maybe even in the States, just hit me up on Twitter, guys. Send me a message and uh, we can definitely chat about it. Uh, that's it, everyone. Have a great day. Good luck with all of your bets. And uh, I'll see you soon with more free picks.